Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm your host today, Mr. Mike, and this is The Game Raiders. Hello, everyone. Today, we have a very special episode of you. We'll be playing Bendy and the Dark Revival, a game that just came out from today, which will be yesterday, whenever I post this video, hopefully. And it already looks from the menu screen awesome. Bendy and the Dark Revival, if you didn't know, is the sequel to the successful indie horror game, Bendy and the Ink Machine, which I have played here on the channel a couple of times. It released back in 2016, or at least the first chapter did, and from then on, it has been hit and success. However, most recently, the fan ver or the fan community has been a bit skeptical of this game's release, and yet, here we are. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to be playing this amazing looking game so far from the menu screen and see what we can find. So, if you all are ready, let's get right into it. Begin! Let's go to options first. Let's take a look at graphics. Okay, hi. Uh, let's turn that brightness up. Motion blur. Uh, controls. Alright, uh, looks like that's it. New game. Let's go with normal. Let's go with normal. Just plain old normal. Here we go. Oh, wait. This is Joey Drew's house. We're always free to choose. Oh, Audrey. To believe what we want to believe. Oh, guys, I'm... But when you step back, when you really look at where you've been and the things you've done, your past will come oh. to devour you. Ooh. Dang. I'm already getting goosebumps from this. Alright. Here we go. June 18th, 1973. It's Audrey! Em Employee of the Month Award. Audrey. Oh, it's looking pretty good so far. Character Here looks kind of wonky, but... And only 800 more frames to go. No way I'm getting through tonight without some coffee. Probably some downstairs. Oh. Oh. Time for a little adventure. Oh. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, I definitely need to increase the, uh, sensitivity. Um... Oh wait, hold on. Is that not the right thing? What's that what? There we go, that's better. All right, let's see. Let's let's examine this office. We got trippy bendy, uh, papers. Nothing much over here. Let's examine the desk. Looks like we got a donut. Uh, panels for cartoons, obviously pens. Key to the office. Looks like storage box. Oh, that's the that's the picture from whenever um from the Benny and the Ink Machine, the ending. Boy of the month, Audrey. Okay, so obviously Audrey is an employee working at Joey Drew Studios. Or something like that. Oh, need a search. Um 
Don't know what that did, but okay. Let's see if we can, can we interact with anything else in this office. It looks like somebody might have worked here with us. Oh, hello. Oh. So we got more animation desks over here. Uh, more locked doors. Fire. Uh, fire extinguisher holder. My vending machine? Can't open that either. Can't even run. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, yeah, that got me there. That got me there. What's this? Nathan Arch. So I believe this was called Arch Films or something like that. Which I assume is the real life version of the... Of Joey Drew's Studios? Okay, it looks like that typewriter. Uh, nothing here. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just looking over at something. More animation desks. Archgate Pictures. Okay. Um. Really? They locked me in? Good thing I brought my own key today. Oh, oh, the key! <coughs> Put this here. Okay, wait, 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 wait. The exact same thing happened parallel to the original Bendy game. Coincidence? I think not. Alright, let's go grab this key and head to the door. Whew. Here's the key. There we go. I gotta say, these animations look good for this, this whole game being in Unity. Which... I will say, from what the trailer looked like, it's definitely an upgrade from the original game. So, really cool. Really nice. Alright, here we go. Not the most welcoming hallway I've ever seen. Um, are you just going to ignore the fact that there's a thingy moving on its own? The, the, the ghostly broom? Hello? Uh. Is someone there? Okay. This looks like the boss man's desk. Still nothing. Hello, spooky broom. You all alone down here? Uh, don't worry. I'm here too. What's in here? Um. Okay then. All right, time to leave. Do, 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 do. Ha, bo, ba, do, do. <laughs> Archgate pictures. That's nice. Do, 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 do. Oh, auto save. There we go. Oh. Audrey. It's creepy Lucy. bald man! Oh wait, or er, partially bald. You scared me to death. I'm sorry, my dear. Didn't mean to frighten you. You're working late tonight. Um. A pretty girl like you shouldn't be wandering around all by yourself. Um. Mind if uh, I step in? Uh, of course not. Thank you, Audrey. You look like you could use a little company. Same thing. What's the <laughs> What's the difference? So, 
It's been really nice this past week. Just beautiful. Gorgeous. Um. What was that? Please tell me we're not trapped in here. Don't you worry, my dear. It's just a little short in this system. Happening a lot these past few days. No uh, need to fret. Uh, um, Let's see what um, we can find. Come along now. Old Wilson will protect you. Well, he's the guy from the poster. You're the evil man, aren't you? Aren't you? Switches to throw. Follow me. That Joey it will be perfectly one. safe. It, it clearly won't because you know you're acting very evil, and that is Joey Drew. Joey Drew, uh, the man and the demon. Hmm. Oh, that's the Alzheimer poster. Let's see, Joey Drew. 1901 to 1971. Joy Drew was the founder of the studio and the man who created Ben Mee, one of the most beloved cartoon characters of all time. In 1929, with the help of his business partner, Henry Stein, he created Ben Mee's first short, Little Devil Darlin. The, uh, as an early talky cartoon, as his entertainment legacy grew over the years, Joey's optimism and pioneering spirit never wavered. Starting with just a pencil and a dream, he created the studio. He would educate pictures where he strived to continue his dream and see Benny live on. Dreams come true. Joey! Joey! You look a lot like Walt Disney. Let's see. Abstract art, I see. We got a banjo and a Boris plush and a... Bendy sing along tape and uh bun ben bun ben ba 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 bendy cut out. I think that's it. Hello Wilson Shall we <gasps> No No it isn't Looks like someone's been messing with the exhibits. There should be something on each of these pedestals. We have to collect Audrey. the things? Sweet Audrey. But that's the shop on the trailer. Do a favor and go find them? I'll tend to the power. We're reli- No, we're reliving it? We what? Oh. Well, there's one. Don't mind that. Not like that can cause anything. Uh, Silvervision is a cartoon format developed by Joey Drew. That allows for animated cartoons to be completed more efficiently, streamlining the pencil and inking stages, allowing for last-minute adjustments to be made directly to the film stock itself. Film was chemically coated to allow for a special formula of ink to be applied by the artist working on the, a magnifying table. This allowed for adjustments, action enhancements, or even whole new characters being to be added after the cartoon had been photographed. Mr. Drew and intended for the format to be used someday to create to create interactive experiences where the cartoons could be custom altered to fit the occasion or audience. Cool. Don't mind if I borrow this from you, Joey? Alright, let's see what else. Um, um, okay, so we can't go back up, so they're definitely all down here. Um, 
Oh, of course, the illusion of living. Can't forget about the book. There we go. That's another. Oh, there's another. A bendy plushie. All right. Um. Oh. And that would be the last item. I think. There we go. Uh, doop -a doop -bop. Nothing bad is ever gonna happen to me. I'm just putting all this stuff down on these random pedestals because it, I was told to do so by a gross old man. And there's one more item. One more. Hmm. I'm trying to think of what all the items were. The original game. Um, this feels like a real life reflection. Is this like a real life reflection of the, of the Bendy game? Because. Oh, what was it? I'm missing one more item. Um, I'm trying to think. So it's not in there. Mm. Oh, that's like a poem written by Mr. Joey Drew. I see. Hmm. Interesting. Oh! Oh, there it was! Boop. Oh, hello, Mr. Wilson. I have acquired all of the items, as you have said. Only one thing left Did you let to me in? do. Oh. Pull that switch. Okay, then. Nothing wrong with this. It is done. Wilson? Oh, Audrey. The um, things you've set in motion. What's happening? The ink is calling us, my dear. Oh, no. Oh, Can't no. you hear it? What? Shh. Don't fret. We're going home. No. Stay back. Listen to me, Audrey. Pay attention to these last words. Because very soon, you will forget everything. Let go! Come find me, Audrey. Come find me, and I'll show you your purpose. What? I'll show you the truth. This can't be real. And now, we die. Oh. What are you doing? Oh, no. No! Uh, uh. I am dead. I am deadified in the ink. <laughs> uh. What an intro! Alright, what's next? We're loading it. Oh. Oh. Oh, I know that screen. Oh. There we are. You're 
Incapied! That's what. Oh, Audrey. What's happened to you? Oh. Okay, I know this. I recognize this. Oh. Relax, the man who killed the ink demon. Wilson knows your purpose. This is giving me a ton of, uh, oh my gosh, Bioshock vibes. Evergate's story begins in mystery. Although things may be dark at the start, the truth will illuminate your way. Don't be afraid of who you are. Fear only what you may become and banish it away. Your best pal. That was interesting. Oh. To grant Cohen accounting, please inform Mr. Drew that despite his insistence that the rumors of Joey Drew Studios going bankrupt are untrue. I want to remind him that if his studio does indeed fail, all equipment and experiments produced through a partnership by contract belong to Gent Corporation and will remain these assets forcibly if necessary. So, Joey Drew is on the verge of bankruptcy and he's not willing to let go of his sweet moolah. So, anyways, um, I need some, oh, I can jump now, yeah! I, I never tried jumping, actually. Alright, can I, uh, welcome home. Alright, so, um. Access my inventory. Okay, I can't go out there, so what do I do? we go. Those look like they'll work as part of a ladder. And also, who is crying? Just stop it. Jeez. Stop crying. It's getting old. Time to climb the ladder. Oh. Those some nice climbing animations. Read. Jeez, you'd think I was drowning kittens all the way all these people are looking at me. I've never seen such disappointment in a person's eyes. But this is the way of things. If management can't pay their bills, then the bank takes the goodies back. Still, it doesn't break me a bit knowing how much I love them old cartoons this place used to make. Oh well, times change, life moves on. Telly Wester. Interesting. Most interesting. Oh! It's a... Jack in the box? A Bendy in the box? Oh! Nice, I guess. Okay, press C to crouch. Oh, my goodness. Attention, children oh. of the machine. This Whoa. is Wilson, your friend, your protector. Hey. For 211 days, you've lived without the ink demon haunting your steps. Oh. I banished him away, tore his body in two, uh. 
return, I ask just a little favor. Among you, there is a stranger, a young lady. Bring her to me. Um, that's no good. <coughs> Joey, Jack and I have been wondering if you can meet meet with us considering the current situation. We have been with you for many years and feel we have contributed to the success of Benny in the past. Our interest is purely in keeping this company strong. We just want to help however we can. Let's talk. Oh. And you can hide as well. Cool, cool, cool. Overall, I've seen great improvement. Let's search. Uh, what do we got? Okay, can't take that. Um. Okay, so he split Bendy in two. At the end of the trailer, we saw the friendly Bendy, like like the regular looking Bendy. Was that? Did he actually split Bendy between his good cartoon side and his bad side? Because that's kind of what it sounds like. The ink drips. Darkness has spread through this studio. The reaching shadows creep around you. Something hungers for your corrupted flesh. That's nice. It is close. So very close. It strains to grab you, choke you from behind. Ah! You will feel its breath upon your neck. It is close. Whatever. I'm sure I'm in no danger at all. You can't prove otherwise. Oh. 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 Thank you. Oh! Hello, governor. Goodbye, governor. Okay, that one didn't get me as bad as the jump scare at the beginning of the game. I just received the call. I heard he was staying in some cramped apartment downtown. You practically hear the rats in the telephone when he called me last April. Oh. In spite of that, old Joey sounded quite happy when last we spoke. More like the excited, hopeful young man I knew once upon a time. <sighs> well, farewell, my friend. What will become of your creations now? Oh. Okay, so Mr. Joey Drew is dead. We know that. And, uh, 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 yeah. Climb. All right. Oh. Plus left shift to run. It's about time. So far, there's only one thing that the. Okay, this sprint bar is actually fine. Never mind. It's fine. It's fine. It's all good, ladies and gentlemen. It's all good. Hello, Bendy. How are you doing? Good, I hope so. Let's see. Uh. Did I just hear? What? Okay, I can't go that way. Guess it's the path of the deep. Oh. It's like the grit. It's like the atrium from Security Breach, but more cartoonish and less big and not as grand. This actually looks pretty cool. So yeah, props go to them. Uh, I don't really uh, see much. If you look at that, they still have the good old, uh, what are they called? Little Miracle Stations. Uh, yep, Buru. Let me 
look around a little bit more. Alright, there's nothing else to see. Let's go. Oh! Oh! Um, uh, that's not too good. Uh. Oh, dang it. I wish I could, uh, oh. Do the punch in thing. Oh no. Oh! <coughs> oh no. This is not good. Run. Run and hide. Hide him. Uh, 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 Alice, Alice Angel, Alice Angel, food, a long health card, a snack. Okay, so there's food throughout the studio, like. Right there. I wouldn't drink too much of that if I were you. It helps patch you Allison. up. Allison! But the aftertaste, it's not so good. Easy now, I'm not gonna hurt you. It looked like you needed some help. Don't touch me. What are you? Ugh, what is this horrible place? Yeah, I remember my first day down here. I know, ah. it's scary. But you're actually pretty lucky. The machine could have turned you into a searcher. You mean that... That thing that attacked me? No, that's a piper. And he's part of a gang, so be careful. I don't understand any of this. I can't think. It hurts. You'll catch on pretty quickly, if you can stay alive. Lesson one. Oh. Searchers don't have legs, and they tend to swarm. Look, it's not good to stay in one place for too long around here. Keep moving, and stay close to the shadows. The animation Take is great advice. in this. Head to the upper levels. It's safer there. Can I come with you? You can't. I'm sorry. I have a wolf. He doesn't care for strangers. Oh, wolf. Oh. Like I said, you'll catch on. Good luck. I hope we meet again. Oh, and one more thing. Above everything else, stay away from the ink demon. What's an ink demon? Well, you'll know him when you see him. He likes to smile, and he kills anything that moves. Uh, Wait! That was nice. What's your name? They call me Alice. I'm not very fond of it. I'm Audrey. Well, Audrey, welcome to the studio. Uh. Chapter 1 Drawn to Darkness. Was that chapter one? Hmm. Whoa. Let's continue. Let's continue. If this if this chapter was only 30 minutes long by the looks of it, then heck with it, we can go to chapter two. Let's do it. Let's see what we got. Okay, we got another letter. Around here, it's just best to stay out of sight. Don't ever go running into some place if you don't know what's in there. If you attack a problem head-on, you're gonna find yourself in trouble, and that's just foolish. You gotta watch, listen, and when the time is right, push forward. Your best pal. So, the animation in this game is also really good. Like, really good. A new terror is descending into our lives. This man named Wilson. Ever since our world f feels strained, like a great beast held in chains, the Ink Demon hasn't been seen in a long time. Many of us re refuse to believe he's really gone. But what does it matter? Down here, we're all sinners, children of the machine, and all have the demon in our inky blood. That's nice. Wait a minute, what? Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. What's down that way? Before, uh, yeah, before I go that way, I'm gonna go over here. See what we got. Um. 
Okay, can't take that. Oh. Your hand uh, seems to be distraught. Let's go back that way and see what was over there. Yeah, I can't even go down there. Let's continue, shall we? All right, let's see. The character model looks pretty good. Not the best that I've ever seen, but it looks... It looks good. Oh, you can... Oh! screeching sound that I've ever heard from a door. And by that I mean uh, it was, it sounded really good. In a way. Um, kinda I guess. Heavenly Boy! I was not finished! Heavenly Toys! Toys, gifts, games from Joey Joe Studios! Let's see what we got here. Okay. Getting a lot of Bioshock vibes from this. Which is... What? Wilson knows. Oh, does he now? What does he know? So, uh, do I just go back then? Hello, Bendy. Hope you're doing good. Me, eh, just turned into an inky monster. No big deal. Oh, there we go. Let's see what we got here. Oh, we're back. Oh, it's open. 
but not open enough. That's interesting. Alright, um, let me see. Where do we go? Let's go back up. Got on our hands here. I uh, can't open that. Oh, there's that good old door sound. I gotta debug this game. I, I literally have to. I gotta beat uh, Terabit games to this. I have to. He won't take the. He won't take the uh, more viewership from me or whatever. I don't know. Uh, Wilson knows. Yes, I know Wilson knows. Oh, there's some bricks. That's nice. Some good old bricks. <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> that fool. That foolish fool. Oh. There we go. A crouch. The machine is ready, Wilson. Wilson to me is just like a discount Joey Drew. I mean, really. Uh, uh, could you? Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, let's see what we got here. Oh. Select upgrade. I'm gonna upgrade my health. Just because. My stamina can regenerate fast. It's not like it's going much of anywhere. Oh, there's some keys, because why not? Unlock... The maintenance gates. Sure. Let me just look around for any more things. Move. Okay. Uh, I moved it. There we go. Easy as cake. With whipped cream and good old ice cream. Two kinds of cream. Iced and whipped. Literally. Alley, Georgia Studios. Back. I need a weapon badly. I really do. Alright, let's save it. Save. Save slot one. Alright. I can't open that yet. Everyone knows that a happy work environment needs a place where you can sit back and enjoy something tasty. I'm Joey Drew, and you're standing in our grand, expensive new employee break room. Oh! Our family always deserves the best. By partnering with Briar Label and Tasty Vans, I'm able to provide the most delicious treats at a very cheap cost to our workers. Oh. Up a chair and chow down, my friends. Oh, yay. Little 
Devil Lounge. Oh my goodness. I just... Oh man, I remember that. Ew! Heck no! No thank you. No thank you. I'm all good. Thank you very much. Hello, spider guy. I forget your name. Hello, sailor guy. <laughs> I forget your name as well. haven't given me anything close to a weapon to use. I have nothing. Oh. Oh. Gent battery. Audrey, it's Alice. Can you hear me? Oh. Hello? Audrey? Oh, I'm so glad you're all right. Uh, Alice, I think you and I have very different definitions of all right. Where are you? Hmm. Animation department entrance? But it's locked up tight. Good. That means you're heading up. Look for hey. anything you can use to break in. Maybe there's a gent pipe nearby. Uh oh. What was that? There's something in here. Audrey, find that gent pipe. Now. Oh crap. Oh crap. Uh uh uh. The gent pipe. Way too dark in there. Need to get the lights working first. Oh, uh, of course. All right, time to get the lights working, and then we gotta do this, and then we gotta do that, and then we gotta do this. No, oh, that's fine. It's fine. It's. Fine. <laughs> Uh, uh. If I find you, I'm gonna rip your face off. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. We're not alone down here. Oh. Missing a fuse. Let's see if I can find one. Alright. Let's find this so-called fuse. Um, okay, so that's locked. So I have to go back to that nasty guy? Oh. That's awesome. Aha. Uh -huh. 
booga booga. Uh, booga booga. Using a cake. Bon appetit. Oh, oh, oh. Lemon. Oh, oh, oh. gen pipe as soon as possible so if you could leave the premises that would be amazing I'm sneaking. A do 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 do. I'm even more sneaking. Hurry up and go. Do 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 do. do 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 do. do 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 do. A peekaboo behind the chair. Crap! Move. Going to be hunted, get out of here. Yeah, that's right, you can't find me. It's impossible. Here, 
really? <sighs> Too bad, you guy. I tried I'm just to that tell good. him he was up to something. I tried to tell him. Let me just look at something. All right, there we go. That's it. Go on that way. That's it. Go on, you little linky piece of crud. I didn't do anything. This is interesting. At the end of every crumbling empire, you gotta hide the treasures. Mr. Cohen brought me in to catalog and secure some of Joey Drew's more special assets in places no one will ever find them. Sure, that sounds completely legal, right? Anyway, I'll be leaving some clues around so we can find them later. Just oh. remember, this nonsense wasn't my idea. So, here's my first little hint. I finally found a use for those silly motivational posters here in the atrium offices. They're sure to make quite an impact. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. What the... Okay, so, um... What? Uh, we're playing with fire, no question about it. First gen comes in here and puts thick heavy pipes over everyone's head. Must weigh a ton. Then Joey opens up the place for tours to the general public. Are we really thinking this through? For Pete's sake, Sammy's music department is constantly flooded. And while I was giving a tour last week, we almost lost a whole dang wall when the valve blew up. Stupid tour group applauded thinking he was part of the show. I know Joey is looking to drum up some cash lately, but this, this is just asking for disaster to strike. One good incident, and there's going to be a landslide trouble. Sounds familiar. Hmm. Who, who else does poor business practices? Um, uh, nah, it can't be anybody who deals with animatronics, can it? And that's also very disturbing. At least now I can defend myself. Yeah! Weapon of many uses! On one tool. I'm gonna rip you apart! Eat it, sucker! Uh, oh, I just took his body for ink. That's nice. Not really. Oh, whatever. Eat bendy bar. Yay! It's a bendy bar. It's a bendy bar. Oh wait, no, I didn't mean to hide. I can't. I'm not gonna hide any from anything now. The machine lives. Give me your ink. I will have your ink. Oh, I will have your ink. Inky ink. Alrighty then, time to go. Can't open that. Alright. Oh wait, I can open this now. Hey, hello, Bendy. 
Management has come up with a new way to reward us employees. Instead of paying out bonuses or overtime, they started handing out these little tokens that you can spend in company vending machines. Besides that, these tokens ain't got any value of any kind. Obviously, a lot of people didn't like the idea. But the best part about the whole thing is that within a week, somebody figured out how to make fake tokens that fools the vending machines. So we started calling fake ones slugs. Now, I can't remember the last time I've seen a real token around here. Them slugs everywhere. Probably costing the studio a tons of money and snacks alone. <laughs> yeah, probably. Ooh. Slugs. 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 I'll take that. Slugs. 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 Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> Eat it, metal door. You're no match for me. But wood? Nah, wood is too. Wood is too bad. Will Sammy Lawrence be in this game, though? Uh, uh. to command because why not use the powers to send monsters back to the dark puddles while crouched down to attack to interact with them there you find to banish them so that was in the original teaser trailer oh. I just disintegrated a puddle man I just disintegrated a puddle, man. Oh, and I didn't mean to spend those slugs, but okay. No! Bolts and locks can stop me! I'm invincible! Oh. That's one leap of faith I definitely yeah, me neither, to be honest. So. Come back out here, you coward. Oh, what? What? Where? Where did he go? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Um, so what do I do? is malfunctioning. Do that. 
so what do I do about that? How do I upgrade my thing? Oh, cool. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, now what? Uh, do I have to put this down on there, or, um... Oh, there's a door! Whenever you have any problem in your life, look for the nearest exit to the situation. And never follow my advice. Like, ever. Ever. Alright, let's pull a switch. My hand is like the symbol of... Or owe me on it or whatever. Die! Eat it, sucker. I will consume your bodies! Sustenance. Oh! Uh. Okay, um. I did not know that was my health bar. It's the Bendy Crew. It's the Bendy Crew. People may say that C is believing, but I think the fine folks down in the audio department might disagree. Once a cartoon's animation is finished, it's ready for all the sound to be added. From music and voices to outrageous sound effects, oh. they do it all. It's no wonder people say Joey Drew Studios has the most impressive talent in the world. Maybe on our tour, you'll get a glimpse of my songwriting. Sandy Lawrence and Jack Fay, working on a new catchy tune with our very own studio orchestra. Or maybe you'll spot Mrs. Allison at the free recording the voice of our favorite little lady sent from above, Alice Angel. On the Joey Drew Studios tour here in Animation Alley, you never know what will happen. So keep your eyes and ears open. But before we head into Magic Don't be like Sister Location. Don't try it. I've seen it before. Oh. Many artists in the art department. You'll be 
be seeing our real Joey True Studios team part ah. in our tour of Animation Alley very shortly. But right here, you can see a typical office where characters are being lovingly crafted with very careful attention to details. I like to stand over their shoulders as the artists work their magic. It's my yeah, job yeah. to catch the little things that make our cartoons really extra special. Yeah. If I see one of Benny's gloves is missing his signature two dots, I make sure I tell someone. That Joey Drew, they like to say, what a keen eye. Over time, the cartoon is slowly created frame by frame. Benny begins to walk and dance. It's really quite fantastic. Before long, we have our finished cartoon. All ready for the boys in the sound department to take over. Yay, I'm gonna leave now. Uh, gent battery refill. I thought I already got the batteries, didn't I? Well, let me double check around here. Alright, let's see what we got. I could have sworn, I mean, I already had a... No. Batteries, right? Right? Yeah, I mean, I mean it looks like I have enough batteries. But I... Oh, okay, this works. Looks like there's some possibly valuable stuff in there. Or in here, now. Gen parts, what is this? We're uh, in the final days here. I can tell people are backing things into boxes. Tools are going missing. You can smell the panic in the air around the studio. But us gent boys, we're just watching from the shadows. We lock the doors and keep our research going. Mr. Gray already gave us a little wink. All is well. When one ship sinks, another one leaves the dock. I just need to keep my ink machine safe in the chaos. It is the key to so many discoveries. Thomas Connor, which I believe he was an engineer, I think. I think. All right. There we go. That should have opened up the door. I think. I think. Most likely. I still can't do anything with that, so I'm not gonna ask. Oh. Okay, this area was on... Train. It's okay. I won't hurt you. I promise. It's okay. Aww. See? I'm your friend. I won't hurt you. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. I, I didn't know that would happen. Oh. I promise. Oh. I'm so, so sorry. Damn it, Audrey. What's uh. happening to you? Well, uh, ladies and gentlemen, actually, hold on, let me save. Uh, save slot two. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I believe that is going to do it for part one of Bendy and the Dark Revival. So far, things are off to a terrific start. I love the story so far. It's not... It, I'm getting a lot of Bioshock vibes from this, I will say. However, it is a good game so far. I really enjoy the cutscenes, and I think it's interesting. So I'm definitely going to be doing a part two of this later on this week. But in the meantime, subscribe, because it took me a while to get this game. 
or it took me a little bit of work to get this game. So subscribe to the channel would be awesome as well as a like, comment, whatever you guys want. But I think that's going to be it, everybody. Once again, thank you so much for watching the video. And I will see you all in the next one. Uh, bye, everybody. Oh.